I keep my ear to the door holding my brother. Personal stories of hardship are a rapper's trademark, but few tell as much as and as soon as Loyal Kana. It's part of what is gaining the 22-year-old a sizable following and tens of thousands of views on YouTube. He's known that he's different for a long time, in part thanks to ADHD, which he was diagnosed with and bullied for as a child. Music is, um, is, is something that really, really calms me down because I've got ADHD, I'm very impulsive. But when I write stuff down, that's actually like what I really want to say or what I really mean to say. So I think kind of the truest or the most honest I'm, or kind of accurate to myself I've ever been is when, I, when I'm writing stuff down. At Paris's Badaboom Club in February, Loyal Kana showed that he has just as much passion when performing as when writing. He's also out to promote his debut album, Yesterday's Gone, which was released earlier this year. There's a bit of a story, can I tell you the story really quickly? That's the tale of how at 19 he lost the only father figure in his life, his stepdad. I my dad. Uh, of course I'm sad. Yo, I miss my dad. Shortly after, he wrote a song about him called Cantona. She was worried about my health, was a worried it was good. I said like ooh, ah. I said ooh, ah. Since I knew what football was, I've been a Liverpool fan. But my dad was a Man Manchester United fan, and his hero was Cantona. I wrote this song about my dad, and because my dad was my hero, it made sense to kind of name it after his hero. Kana's repertoire includes songs about lighter subjects too, like text messages and girls. Yeah, I just want to get a nice house in a quiet place and a big dog. Um, and yeah, fall in love, which I'm trying to do at the moment. Next up for Kana is an international tour which includes gigs in Switzerland, Australia and the US.